the oscillation of the eccentric crank is mechanically operating a pumping mechanism, is forcing vaguely nutritive slurry, total parenteral sustenance, TPS, from an armature outside through the aluminium tissue, manto slurry, deposition, decale, withering the skin, and softening the meatless fascia is grating the ribcage into bone meal against pocky aluminum. The young boy in coveralls is cutting the coastline perimeter of Demonaz Island into a press board, pegboard panel, for the ADA cartographer is receiving a pegboard simplification of the coastline of Demonaz Island from his assistant, who is attaching a plumb line from a hole in the pegboard and inscribing its vector down across the panel and through a series of plumb line vectors in a variety of orientations is finding the centroid of the island on which the cartographer is delineating Demonaz Island Transit Camp on his official chart. Nauseating coldness rushing into the apartment massive without my overcoat. ADA greatcoat draping over the small bookshelf, concealing the man as rifling through as peeling brittle endpapers from the books with the apex of a dagger, is pointing into our crockery and cookware. Nadia miserably, darkly laughing, weeping at what the ADA goon is imagining of my stealth for concealing a 200-page article manuscript in a teacup. And the absence of food is scopically limiting, is ransacking to prying apart the laminations of plywood cabinet doors and drawing the dagger through caulking between precast concrete wall panels and dissecting the foamy backer rod extractingly uncoiling across the mat floor. I'm genuinely fearful of his cutting away her scalp and pounding open Nadia's skull with the pommel of his dagger and transcribing the honest light of facsimile projecting from the crater. And he is standing like a tent in his great coat in front of the door where two other goons and coveralls are entering for my bodily apprehension, all oblivious to their quarry. My article is lying in the lid of a paper box, methodically stackingly and collating its cover page as stating letter to the demon concerning the assassination of Katia in full bleed, elegant reverse contrast handle lettering are removing me from my dwelling in the massive on Missouri Boulevard blackout, naughty, a gray space, filtration away from her bodily safekeeping into shell game with skulls full of black blood, draping, itchy, black wool, pericranium, cannot luminance, cannot relief. Is rhythm a possibility without sequentiality of events, but in a static arrangement across which the notation of or indexing of aspirationally rhythmic constructions is perceptible, yet is requiring an imaginative insertion of movement or possibility of parallax against which relative positioning is gaugeable from one rhythmic body to a benchmark in the distance. The, the event is finite in one axis and expansive beyond comprehension or beyond necessity on the planarity. The entire topography of my body is contacting other bodies, pilingly, crushingly, cannot breathingly, wheezing, gravitational additive constriction with no sensation, only analytically surveying the wafering of negative space. Touchingly, contact points are sensations of analysis, not valuable to the imagination, cannot sensation with a kneecap, cannot movement, restraint by crushingly dead weight of my people cannot respiration, provision for hermetically looping oxygen production in each cell of the ingot, cannot vision, I'm not desirous of visual, screaming as muffling, the leathery wings of the point eye, vibrating in a fringing, softly sounding formation of draconi, vomiting, Molten aluminum, macro. I'm seeing the grain of fabric, cakingly dirt shit, scabbiness, living organisms with minimal overhead clearance are preparing the surface with the devourment of organic materials with the properties antagonistic to the bondage of molten aluminum to flesh. Moth larvae are eating the fibers in our thin clothing. I'm away from the dwelling without an overcoat, bartering for tea beneath a dark window, lamplight in the window, apprehension on the sidewalk. Nadia's shoulder blades against the window. My people cannot copromesis, cannot swollen in the encapsulation of aluminum casting. The tormenting stability of encapsulation is overriding the scorching torture of liquid aluminum. Cannot interpunct. No spatial distinguishingly and sculptural live ossification of cell block conception of relational. We are packing into the ingot, lying ceilingly in immediate proximity. Support network suppression cannot fellowship, moth froth of tineola baselliella, attempting whispering, without labial, cannot m, cannot p, cannot b, I've the realization that I'm aboard a rail car. Quanaplegia, moth froth of tinea pelianella, 
gently rocking with no inertial effects on my extremities in the void eye of the breathless body pile tourniquet void. Cells cannot reconfiguration. My liquefaction is swaying my equilibrioception as clackety clackety, vomiting malabsorption feces into the aluminium tissue as gravity draining xylem, is forcing differential pressuring, transportingly delivery via the slurry column. Onward as momentum, exhalation, onward, clack, clack, swaying, threadbare, trousers, and sphincter is gasping, plugging with the forcing aluminum impaction into rectal negative space, paradoxical diarrhea through enterocutaneous fistula burn wounds, cannot bowel movement, under the skin and inside the long bone marrow tunnel, the noxious reeking of the crucible smoke, glimpsingly crescents and slivers of the trailing across the sky, is precipitating down into the rail car. Acrid kiln smoke drafting from chimney aromatic of warmth is not enough warmth, exacerbation of cryoblation. In the body pile, the adjustment of posing is tantalizing but impossibly stiff, cramping is not unpleasant nostalgia of the musculature, constraining with crushing liquefaction of aluminum at 1680.67 degrees R in a freezing gale, proving the dyxis of burning through flesh, dermis, adipose, musculature, Skeletal exposure, S-char, conditional flesh-eating molten metal is cooling into an ingot of casting medium in the negative space of the body pile. Clothing burning, lacy clothing of moth devourment, the skeleton of the caverniculus exile is lying in the depressions of its aluminum body chamber. Pooling of geotrichum, candidum, penetration into porous aluminum casting. In a rail yard overlooking Lake Baikal, Fecal diagnostic panels from ball valve tapping phreatic zone liquid of the nutritive tissue is draining into clinical tubes. Exile urine treatment in the urine processor assembly, UPA, is commingling with condensate recovery in the slurry vessel. Penetrative sarma gales of the circumbical, swayingly, freezingly, and thawingly artesian slurry vesicle, diarrhea cannot consciousness, contrarily the existence of the body heat, in infinite events across the step is not the existence of the body heap stationary in each event, is not me with some enduring proximity to Nadia, to familiarity or stability. Exhalation is not a radial concept of further and further. Exhalation is a recentering, an exhalation from the refreshing of each center point, not the distancing of the exilee from home place, but annihilation of the very acknowledgement of home place as a geographic ideal. Erasure of a locus of hopefulness, ceaselessly wailing, each home place, each investment and stasis is precipice encampment, crumblingly tumbling down the sloughing of the mountainside, glimpsing all of the appealing crags and pinnacles, recognizing nothing, and fog enshrouding the mountaintop. Is there a mountaintop, or are we lying in the debris field of a crater? Sky vault of oil cloth, vaulting fabric of the sky is flutteringly, indexically, is fraying, webby, gauzy snowfall and snow melt through the distantly threadbare oculus, the illumination of Kevlar mittens, leather palms, and wool lining. Fibrous falling threadbare mountainside is whispering to the geometric cascading with dividers, and the spotlight is flaring a tangibly stellate figuration above the patent leather visor of the commandant, is floating down to a resting point on the specular metal of the dividers, are pegging radii outward and outward across the cartographic depiction. Asleep in bed is bondage and bedclothes atonia, cannot drifting away, cannot nodding or slumping or relaxation. Dreaming has the requirement of peacefulness. The atonia of entombment is rageful, cannot relaxation and disuse atonia. Hide and die in carbomoclonine, slurry, torpor, habitat, or raging against the dracon poin. Slurry mixture of carbostat in the slurry medium delivery vehicle. The entombment harboring troglazenic aspirations for daylight on the dermis, on the clothes, warming, dead cave, Nadia. Nadia far, far away, further away, Nadia setting behind the earth. <clears throat> Bodily, meltingly dripping skeleton of the balmy steppen low point to the scions, ascendingly stonavoys, cooling the flesh onto my skeleton, casting adipose material, diffeomorphic into the aluminum vesicle, my chamber, 
my formation, my limitation, fully bodily erasure of scalding, geographically deictic thermal burning is dependent on the air temperature, although damaging the dermis at a minimum is unavoidable. Vection, lingual screaming through the tissue, death wheezy whispering breathly clicking through the tissue, the irregular breathing of weeping, deferral of domestic uncertainty as the construction of a cord and the compassing from the endpoints of the cord with equal radii, whose interlinking intersections are serving as the endpoints of a radical line, whose intersection is finding the center point of the cord, and through which is the construction of a perpendicular diameter, and construction of a second cord, utilizing the identical construction such that the two diameters are intersecting at the center point. New center point, new radius, inscription, new cord, attempts, new location, the stellate figuration luminously sloughing to the paper, Dracolastgok is the location for exhalation and involuntary railcar transporter entombment and molten aluminum is casting in the negative space between exilees where a loose weave of wax paper straws are weavingly casting a xylemic conduit tissue. Warmly, female voice hesitantly is describing her emotional connection to human cadavers. Cross lamination with tinny reverberant yelling woman, food slurry is pumping into the vesicle between skin and over rib cage and aluminum casting medium pooling food slurry is freezingly pulling away from the skin, warming expansively. Nostrils cannot peristalsis, alumino stricture whispering through the aluminum tissue. Aluminum cannot tracheary. Megalovalvata bicolensis, spiraling, sphincteric, sliming, cannot eyelid, wax paper, ignition, metal smoke, and pyrolization of aluminum cenospheres, and lingual pyrography, anchialine pooling, salting, the hydrology of the sky is raining corrosion on the body pile and salting the lips of the exilees drinking from the tissue, generally silent weeping is palpably aromatic through the tissue saline vaporization, cannot F cannot V, the thinly gurgling drowning on food slurry against labialization of aluminum, cannot kissing, cannot favorite, cannot parabola, cannot paving, cannot bivouacking, haphazard arrangement of straws into the casting is allowing for no coordination of tissue orifices with mouth holes or nostrils is no assurance of nutritive administration. The poini descending on the oculus of the cattle car, vomiting molten aluminum over the scrambling, heaping exilees, Hot gale at the Dracolastcock seaside, whistling daylight is seemingly thinly articulating the straminous tissue capillaries. Nothing visible but sensation across the eye spots. Activation is the vection of horrendously strident creaking, warming, expandingly. My entirety of aluminum sleep cell, paralyzed cell, involuntary endurance arrival at a, at a transit camp on the peninsula, at a desolate location centrally distant from the coastline in each direction. Cannot bacterial vaginosis, cannot pablum, cannot favela, cannot bumping, cannot beneficium. The exile ingot hoisting from the flat car into the flat bed of an auto transporter is crossing the strait to Demonaz Island Transit Camp through strata of fence lines and fortifications onto a turntable at the centroid of the island. Beside an armature is hoisting and overturning the container is releasing the ingot of exilees onto a shaking table platform where hosings are coupling to the ball valve tappings for fluid drainage. Inversely, at the top of the tissue network for fluid injection, is flooding liquid gallium through the tissue, is promoting molecular embrittlement of the shattering aluminum, casting bodies scattering across the shaking table or scrambling across the flat platform, clawing and covering their eyes, throwing themselves from the platform to the dirt, terminal burrowing into the hard soil, going nowhere, or scraping their faces against gravel, back and forth into a growing crater filling with blood, drowning in blood. The auto transporter is ferrying away, toward the gateways in the fortifications are closing shut behind its departure.